Filipino blogger. What's up, guys? I'm with my Nang Dini here, my brother's wife, and she's cooking today a pancit, but there's two different noodles to it. That's my Nang Dini right there. Let's just start cooking now. Anyway, I'll show you guys the recipe. That's oil. That's one of her ingredients. This is her own ingredient here. And this um, one here. Red onions, garlic, carrots, red peppers. This is chicken breast, but the chicken breast here has still the bones attached to it. Um, you like, I know in Canada, they would take the bones out, but this one here, it's not. And this is just cabbage. And this is the magic syrup. Soy sauce, Mama Sita, that's what she is going to use. And she is going to put two noodles to it. This one here is the Bihon uh, Canton and the uh, Pancet. These are all Filipino noodles. So, anyway, she starts cooking now. So, again, this is her own recipe here. So, she just add. Uh, garlic into her uh, uh, oil and then onions Let's use onions first red onions that's what she's using okay, so now she added a uh, chicken breast to she start cooking it so what she did she just added uh, Water in it. How many cups did you add? One. One cup One of cup. water. And then I'll just put my pillow in. I'm going to add uh, syrup. This is her own recipe, guys. To make pancit. Everybody has a different recipe. I'm just giving you a mix. Bihon. That's the bihon. Uga, one kata ugu, one kata ugu there. I see. If it's dry, you have to add more water to it. So that one there, you have to add water because it's dry. Diba? Mm -hmm. So she's doing it dry, so that means that she has to add water to it. Put the lid on and let it boil. Um, she's going to give it a good stir. Let's get a good mix. It's delicious already. It's dry now, so it's going to add more water. Because our mango sticks a lot of water. Alright. Then she's going to add oyster sauce. That's a secret recipe. Yeah, I would say about... Maybe, maybe about 4 teaspoon. Or tablespoon, I think. That's what she's using. And give it a good night of good stir. Put 
looks good. Then she's going to add the B ah B ham. Canton. Canton. Pancit Canton. I know those. Pancit noodles. Again, she does it her way. Alright, it's all in and add more water. Put it back on. Alright, now she's going to give it a good stir. She might have to add water, I don't know. Because our noodles will absorb all this water. It really looks yummy. Again, this is the first time I see the making a pan set with two different kind of noodles. And this yeah. is her own recipe, so. And of course we have to add more water to it because the noodles took all the water. Again because um, what I do with this is I yeah, the way I do it is I um, soak my noodles to uh, hot water so I don't need to add lots of uh, water to my fancy but the her way is putting it in there without making it um, not soaking it with the water so it's a different way of doing but the result you just have to add more water to it if it's getting dry that's what she's doing so she's going to add more water to it because um, again the noodles need a lot of water and then she's going to add more oyster sauce so. Alright guys, our pan set just about ready I think. So we're gonna add another one more. One more of the roasted sauce and it should be done. All the ingredients is in it and a little bit more of oyster sauce so it's basically what we put in it for to make it tasty uh, the um, oyster sauce she was gonna use magic sauce and I told her to use the oyster sauce I know it's her own ingredient but um, I believe the magic syrup has uh, MSG to it so that's why I just told her to use the oyster sauce because it's, um, it's better for us So we're going to try it soon here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hi guys, the moment of truth. I'm going to try my sister and all's pancit. Mm. Really good? No, it tastes really good. So last there and that's it. Mm. Alright, have a good eyes, this is done. The Filipino blogger. <laughs>